What is up guys? My name is Mark Santa Maria. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the RC vlog. Actually, this is a race vlog guys. We are, oh, you can't see my face, but there we are pitting. We are at Shaw's RC in Ardmore, Oklahoma, doing some old school racing, like straight up off the tailgate, canopy, family here, having a great time, racing monster trucks. Yes, yes, that clip that you saw at the beginning is a nitro monster truck, a max, the racing monster truck. This is the truck nationals, super excited. But that's not what this video is all about. Today, I'm gonna hand my Traxxas slash Ultimate over to the legend of Traxxas, Mr. Mike Battelle. He claims that he can guarantee put the car on the podium. Guarantees to put the car on the podium. My car is pretty much stock. All I did was, actually, let me just show you what I did. Let me show you what I did. Here is my slash ultimate. So I have the techno drive shafts on here and I put all the red anodizing parts, but nothing that's really gonna make it perform. It's gonna increase the durability, but nothing that's gonna make it perform any better than a stock slash ultimate, aside from the center chassis brace, which you can get at Traxxas. But for the most part, we're even making them run <laughs> the stock tires. He's gonna run this thing and he says he's gonna put in podium, just like this, just like that right there. It looks so freaking good. Um, I will say I drove this a long time ago when the Platinum first came out and it's really not that bad of a truck. So I do believe that he might be able to put on the podium. The only reason why I hesitate is because that guy's racing. He's definitely gonna be, that's one podium spot for sure. So there's not very many podium spots. There's one already missing, that's all I'm saying. So let's go meet Mikey B. All right, our driver, Mr. Mike Battelle is actually in the bathroom right now. <laughs> We're gonna get him coming out. Um, Melissa's holding his car. The slash. Oh, there he is. There is the winner. This is the guy that says that he can put the Traxxas Slash Ultimate on the podium. Yes. Yeah, that's a solid yes. yes. <laughs> no, no hesitation. All right, so there's a couple things I got to tell you real quick. Hold on. All right, a couple things I got to tell you is uh, one, I don't have the my phone binded to that one, and yeah. it's got TSM on. So if it's super stable, that's because it's got TSM. What does that mean? <laughs> Just drive it. It's going to be super stable. Okay. It's not going to peel out of the cords or anything. Um, yeah, dude, you got it. Look, you even have a thumb steer steering wheel on that thing. Rotate? Huh? Rotate? What do you mean rotate? I'm like, what, rotate? I might, I don't know. But you're, oh, but you're the corners, so. yeah, maybe, I don't know. Oh, all right. But you're Mike Battelle, so you should be able to make true. it. That's true, that's true. You got, you got this, bud. Yeah. This is, how, how many national champions do you have? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have enough fingers for that? But he did, he used to run the Slash. He was yeah. one of the first ones that drove the Spec Slash. He was one of the first ones to drive this slash. He used to run this slash when the short course showdown uh, was going on. Oh, AMS, and, anything. and he, he yeah. railed that thing. So, yeah. like I said, the only reason why I don't think he's going to put on the podium is because there's one less spot already since I'm running. And if you lo if you beat with my own car, I'm not going to air this video. Got, look, stock tires on there. Eh? Stock tires too, dude. That's crazy. You got this, right? Yeah. All right, man. We're going to see. All right. All right, guys. We're going to have to get a little creative because I'm race 10. I'm actually race 11 uh, with Mike, but I asked to switch. 145 entries today. 145 entries. Truck that. There he is. There's, there's Mikey B coming out with the car. Anyways, so I'm race 10. So after my race, I'm going to have to come down, get my camera, and then we're going to record... I'm, I'm a little scared about TSM on that thing. It's going to be hard to drive with TSM, I think. It's either going to be awesome or hard. Hey, careful with that body. It's pristine. That body is perfect. Come on, dude. I thought you said you know about these. Yeah, you push the, you push the, just push the button in there. Oh, yeah. yeah. 11 years. 11 years, he said. Oh, look how good it looks, though. It looks good, doesn't it? Hey, don't worry about those rear shocks. Uh, hey, I said don't worry about them, bro. You can, you can raise them if you want to. No, that's a little. All right, here we are. Mikey B's coming up here somewhere. He's up here somewhere. He's where, Where's he at? Let's see, where's he at? Where's he at? Oh, my God. Hey, Mike. All right, we had a minor problem. Minor glitch. He did not have a transponder. So They have house transponders here, which is really good. So we were able to throw a transponder here. There's the car. It looks like he's waiting for some some time there. I'm just gonna glance oh, over. I did forget to say during the driver's meeting. Okay, I was just checking. Sense, uh, checking up there to make sure that he's counting. So he's counting, so he's good. Alright, there we go. We got some chicken I'm looking back. There and we found a little bit of bullets in there. Uh, I mean, at that rate, I definitely see it in the egg, that's for sure. So, that's just kind of funny. I hope he doesn't beat me. 
That's a that's a three S. A Millennium three S system. Oh my god, he's running that thing good. Uh, I'm a little concerned right now. Oh god, it's dump truck dog slow on the straightaway though. You're in a 37, that's actually pretty good. My pass was a 36-2. Oh my god, he's driving in that thing good. He's driving that thing so good. Oh, I, I'm kind of... Uh, I'm kind of scared he's going to qualify me, guys. Holy crap, that is good fun. Alright, I put a mic on. That way we can get rid of some of that noise. Um, but I'm not going to lie, I'm impressed. It looks like it's underpowered. But in regards to like stability on the track, that's not bad at all, guys. All it has is the techno drive shafts, the center chassis brace. Like, I'm not even doing that in my car. I need to start doing that. Oh god, that looks good guys. I'm not gonna lie, I'm impressed. It's just so underpowered, like our cars are all screaming down the straightaway. Uh, these cars not so much. Or his car not so much. I guess that's my car. But holy crap guys, that's actually pretty solid. Let's see how he's doing on the uh, on the leaderboard. Oh, we'll, we'll finish this lap because that's a good lap. Like that thing handles pretty freaking good. Oh man, see I don't do this. I'm like rolling stuff. Oh, but I did run a faster fast lap, so maybe my way is is faster, but Yeah, it is dump truck dog slow down the straight though. That is freaking insane. So as of right now, he is out qualifying me. I ran an 808, 5, 508, 8508, which and he's running at 8501. Oh my goodness. Robert Shaw, if you can come to the RDB, please. Robert Shaw, please. Robert Shaw please. That, uh, yeah. he's about to RDB, please. Yeah, he's about to qualify me, guys. Because he's running consistent. I don't see him making any mistakes. But there's another qualifier. Oh my god. This is, this is bad, guys. Do I air this video? Maybe I don't air this video. <laughs> I'm just joking. Of course I'll air the video. Oh man. This is uh, quite a conundrum. Top six of the race are all nine lap races, ahead of that P2. That's insane. Carl, Cannon, Jim, and Mike all on the All in Absolutely insane. It's all pretty close. It jumps good in everything. That looks good. Oh. That is insane, guys. What'd you say? Robert Shaw to the RDB. Yeah. Robert Shaw to the RDB. Mike and Ultimate. Oh. Yeah, he's in the nines. He's out qualifying me. That's pretty bad. Hey, Tim, you got beaten by a slash Ultimate. It's not over. I, I got beaten by a slash Ultimate, too. Dude, you out qualified me, bro. I know, right? Dude, no, don't, don't I know right, man? Hey. Uh, hey, that's on stock, on stock nine. That's stock everything, pretty much. Oh, my God. That is so bad. I don't. I just still don't see him being on the podium. On the podium still? Yeah, we just drove it for the first time. So now we need to, I don't know if we leave it or, I don't know. That, that's a good point. He said he just drove oh, for the first it. time, so. I mean, I just drove it the first time, but it's a stalker. That's all right. All right. And with this too, man, it's weird. You know what <laughs> Stock radio and everything. It's crazy. <laughs> all right. So, something happened. I knew in that second qualifier I had to turn it on, and I did. I was flying, guys. Like, flying, flying. I was on TQ. And uh, yeah, I end up breaking. I'll show you what I broke. And I end up missing the freaking A. But you know what, my car feels way better. I made some adjustments. But yes, it's official. My slash ultimate out qualified my actual race truck. But I'll put an asterisk next to that, star next to that, because that's broke. Take a look, take a look at my car. All right guys, so here it is. Yeah, my connector came on solder. Before you guys ask, yes, I run Traxxas connectors because I run Traxxas batteries in my short course uh, because I didn't want to have to bring multiple chargers. So now I only brought the ID charger since we're running so much spec slash. And yeah, it came on solder. I'm talking last lap, TQ, I was flying, car felt amazing, and uh, that happened. So I got to get that fixed. I'm 100% confident I'll seal the deal in the main, so y'all don't worry. 
Hopefully it doesn't beat me overall, but it's fun. We're having a great time. All right, guys. So I didn't, I didn't get beat overall. I ended up bumping out of the the B, going to the A. I got seventh over, overall. I think Mike got ninth or something like that. But I did beat him, so I didn't lose to my own slash ultimate. That would have been, that would have been pretty bad. But I'm not gonna lie, guys. The slash ultimate handles really, really well for a car that's an RTR. I was super impressed. He was super impressed. Uh, we think that if you just add a little bit more power, the problem is the power system, does, it, there's just not enough there. Uh, maybe if we're in it on 3S, um, but he just lacked power. Once he hit the straightaway, I mean, all of us kind of just, you know, we could we could catch up to him really, really quick. So it's dark, it's late, it's cold. Uh, Melissa's staying warm <laughs> and the uh, under the canopy with the heaters, but oh, overall, great time. And yes, thumbs up on the slash ultimate racing. So I hope you liked this video guys. If you did smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell, and you guys will see me next time. Later guys.